Hey, how's it going, everybody? Nas here. Welcome to Nostalgic. Uh, today we have an unboxing. This is a box from Steve, Mr. Steve. Miniature Mustangs right there. Hopefully you can see that. <laughs> Miniature Mustangs. Uh, it's a YouTube channel. Make sure you go check him out. My man does some awesome content. He's an artist. He's a collector. He's a fantastic father, family man, just a all-around good person that supports a lot of different causes and um, one of the most selfless people I know like anyway Steve thank you um the rest of you guys I uh, just want to uh, say this announcement really quick uh, before I open this box um, this box is for the next Hot Wheels for Ukraine auction that's gonna be at the end of March 2024 basically like the last Saturday of March so keep that in mind uh, if you're a customizer, like you make custom Hot Wheels, I invite you to help, to help our cause here. Um, by the way, all of our proceeds, funds, whatever we get on these auctions, for the past two years we've been doing these auctions every few months or so, it all goes to Ukraine, guys. I send this money personally through PayPal and other whatever to Lviv, Ukraine. It goes to volunteers there that gather this money and they use it for either humanitarian aid, for uh, buying uh, vans, for buying drones, for buying food, uh, for uh, fixing transportation for volunteers and people on the front lines. They deliver food to soldiers. Um, they deliver food to people who are dislocated, to people who don't have homes. They help them find homes. These volunteers, like, flat out straight out this is why i love these guys i know some of them personally there might be a family member in there as well so i know this is all like 100 percent legit they're not like an organization these are people that are helping other people they're volunteers in the purest sense of the word volunteers they just got up they're like i'm gonna make a difference i'm gonna make a change <sighs> that's all we do so just wanna um invite all of you uh customizers of diecast if you guys can or uh, have the desire to uh, make a custom or two and send it my way, um, reach out to me if you do on Instagram or my email. Um, email would be bignaz at yahoo.com right there. Uh, or on Instagram, which would be, um, <laughs> which not big nod, it would be nostalgic underscore productions. So reach out on any of those, hit me up, be like, hey man, I want to send a custom or two for this auction at the end of March. Hey, you have a whole month to make a custom. If you have some customs, just send a couple my way. Um, so yeah, reach out on those things. Let me know. I'll give you an address to send stuff to. And um, yeah, we'll take it from there. So uh, in advance, thank you. So far we have about seven different uh, custom artists, uh, customs from seven different uh, customizers. Different levels from like craziness to like some basic stuff, maybe some wheel swaps. So we're going to have different price tiers. And again, 100% of this goes to Ukraine, guys, like 100%. But um, yeah, guys, uh, in advance, thank you for that. Uh, if you can't donate uh, customs, um, you know, just be there at the end of March. Stay tuned to my channel. I'm going to do uh, updates. I'm going to unbox every video with a custom or any kind of donation. I'm going to show you what it is, who it's from. Everyone gets props. So uh, keep, keep all of that in mind. But yeah, um, so <laughs> Steve Miniature Mustangs. He always comes through, guys. I, I can't thank him enough. Uh, he sends either his customs or he'll send his customs and amazing stuff like supers or RLCs or whatever. I think there's some of that in here. Um, it's crazy, man. So, uh, yeah. Um, stay tuned, though. There's a couple boxes on the way already, so I'm looking forward to that from a couple other guys. But uh, I just wanted to invite a couple of uh, maybe some new blood. I think this will be a great opportunity for other customizers to get to know each other, for uh, people to get new customs into their collection. Like, see this? I collect customs. Like, at these auctions, I usually set aside like 300 bucks and I bid on stuff as well. I'm no slouch, man. Um, so yeah, uh, I have a whole bunch of stuff from different people, including some customs from Steve and uh, many others. So um, yeah, those of you who are looking for new things to collect. Um, Look into customs, man. You get a one-of-a-kind piece in your collection. You buy a custom, and your money is going to support a good cause. So this way you have something you can remember, or you have a story attached to it. You can tell your grandkids, your nephews, your um, 
friends, whoever, be like, oh yeah, this custom, this awesome badass custom, I got this at the Hot Wheels for Ukraine auction. It was made by this amazing person who's an incredible artist, you know, stuff like that. So um, I encourage uh, custom collecting. Uh, so we're also going to have a lot of, I already have a ton of um, amazing like rare cars, super treasure hunts, treasure hunts, uh, all sorts of RLCs and stuff that either people donated and I've purchased and added to the pile, like Kaido House, all sorts, like no like cheap, nothing mainlining. And um, so yeah, I, I'm not sure if I'm gonna mix those. I want this uh, March one to be just for customs, just for customizers. So I think that's gonna be like a cool little thing to do. Um, but before that, I might do either a claim sale of the other stuff or maybe do another auction before that. I'll figure something out, but stay tuned to this channel. So yeah, um, sorry, <laughs> I, had to, I had to fill you guys in, um, you know, on what's going on, what this is for. Uh, and I tried to keep it as short as freaking possible. So, Steve, miniature Mustangs. This is who this is from. Let's uh, let's have a look see in here. All right. So, there you go, <laughs> Steve. This was packed perfectly, and I can't believe that I set the box up the right way. Ooh, a new card from Steve, dude. I started collecting these. Uh, Mike's Customs also does these, and there's a bunch of. Um, uh, customizers that do these cards so I kind of want to make these as well now but how cool is this little card here all right so there's a note it says Nas for your auction I included three of my customs three wow uh, that's awesome Ooh, um, one JB custom die cut oh man JB custom guys I have JB custom uh, customs uh, by JB customs um, he's uh, on whatnot. He makes amazing freaking customs. I have like three or four of them, and I think I'm gonna donate one as well for the auction. Uh, make some good. Um, but anyway, um, plus a recent RLC. Awesome. Keep the mat for yourself. Ooh, nice. Good luck, Steve. Awesome. Thank you, Steve. Guys, once again, please support your uh, good people that support others. Uh, go subscribe to Steve's channel. He does giveaways often. Um, okay, Steve, this is a surprise. First of all, this is a surprise. Second of all, I've been wanting to buy a mat. <laughs> I've been wanting to buy a mat. I've been looking. I've been trying to get, like, the parking lot one or whatever. And... Uh, they're like 30 40 bucks man so like i was like hey you know i almost got the lamley one uh whatever so i don't know which one this is yet so let's uh let's have a look oh no way i love this guy i almost got this bro steve thank you i almost bought this from this guy shop 164 guys shout out Shop164 is also a customizer and he sells uh, a ton of wheels for 164 Customs. I have like three baggies uh, full of 164 wheels for my wheel swaps or customs or whatever. So how freaking cool is that? <laughs> Man, you got a little R35 freaking action over here. I love this, man. This is so cool. Man, I'm telling you, dude, you put something out there into the into the universe and it just... Uh, thank you. This is like the perfect thing. I wanted this. I needed this. I love you, Steve. You're awesome. All right, so let's get to this. Let's uh, have a look at the RLC, then we, we'll get to everything, um, including the customs, which I'm so excited to see. All right, so RLC. Oh, no way. Yeah. Awesome. So this is the 71 AMC Javelin AMX. That's a good one. I love the paint job on that. I hope you guys are seeing all this just fine. Look at this. Very nice. So this is a uh, number... 25,557 out of uh, 30,000. Wow. 
Yeah, 30. Wow. Dude, this thing's immaculate. What a cool little piece. So there you go. So by the way, I'm still not sure how I'm gonna do this. Like, I'm still kind of, because I really want to do just customs to keep the next auction kind of not five hours long because we we get a bunch of stuff and sometimes it, it tends to run because we also have a little bit of fun as well during these auctions so um yeah man <clears throat> okay i'm gonna save steve's customs for the end let's have a look at jb's custom first good wait Miniature Mustangs. Is this JD? That says Miniature Mustang. That says Miniature Mustang. Oh, here we go. <laughs> All right, I'll get this box down. All right, guys, I can't see myself in the camera. I'm using like the better cameras on the other side, on the, I guess the back of the phone. Uh, so hopefully I'm in the shot. Hopefully I'm not like, oh, hi everyone. How's it going? <laughs> so yeah, sorry. I'm a little giddy because, um, I can never get used to people's generosity and kindness despite of anything. And, um, yeah, man, Steve, just thank you, sir. <clears throat> By the way, that last Bob Ross painting you did with your daughter, I believe, you did pretty good, man. Both of you did pretty good, man. Uh, Maggie and I were actually talking, and we're like, we should go do that. <laughs> uh, okay, so this is the JB Custom Diecast Patina series. No way. Okay. I haven't seen one of his patinas in real life yet. So I'll leave that on there. Let's have a look at this. So all of JB Customs come with like a little sticker there and he signs the bottom of the case. I'm still not sure which one I'm gonna donate. I might not even donate one, they're that good. <laughs> oh. Okay, I'm gonna be bidding on that. <laughs> I need to show this off. I will be taking some glamour shots of this on um, my Instagram, so definitely check out uh, nostalgic underscore productions okay check that out man how cool is this thing man That's awesome. Steve put one on. That's why I was confused because it had a sticker on there. So yeah, this is so we all know this was donated by Steve, which is a very good idea to be honest with you. Ah, oh, patina series. Okay, I was like, I never seen that sticker before either. That's because it's the patina series. That's awesome. Alright, this thing is cool. Alright. I'm really hoping I'm getting this good for you guys. I, I'm, I hope it's all in the shot. I'm really hoping, hoping the best for this video. Oh my god, that is so cool. You like it? Cool. <laughs> Mr. Horsepower. Damn, JB. <laughs> I don't care who you are, man. This thing's badass. JB's freaking... Guys, check him out on Whatnot, by the way. Uh, his shows are fun. Like, even if you don't buy anything, his shows are freaking awesome. But buy stuff? You know? But yeah. JB Diecast Customs. So yeah. Steve, thank you for uh, sacrificing one of his customs, especially one that this freaking cool. I love this thing, man. What a beautiful piece. All right. Um, oh, yeah, that's right. I'm still going to take photos of this, so not packing this up yet. But, yeah, there we go. Steve, thank you so much, man. Whew. Just a reminder. 
This is from Steve, miniature Mustangs. <laughs> All right, box. Okay, here we go, next box. <sighs> so yeah, guys, um, I actually like started a WhatNot account. I was gonna see if maybe I could um, try doing one of these Hot Wheels for Ukraine auctions on WhatNot, but um, honestly, I'm not sure if I can do that. Like. I'm a little, like, weirded out by it, plus there's, like, all these, I guess, fees and all this other stuff that's uh, involved in that. I'm not sure if, like, I want to do that, plus I really like to keep it in, like, the nostalgic community here and all of you guys coming through with the diecast community. It's, it's like, I don't know, I like that. It's more personable, you know? Like, people kind of, a lot of people know who I am, they trust me. I know a lot of people who come in, I trust them. Then new people come in and, like... Uh, you know, they're friends of friends. It's, I don't know, it's more like, like a family thing, you know, Fast and the Furious family. So I really enjoy doing that, to be honest with you. So, wow, that <laughs> I haven't seen it yet, but uh, I kind of dig that. So, um, where was I? So yeah, uh, yeah, you know what? Uh, let me know down in the comments below. I'm still like thinking about it. So the auction is happening at the end of March, right? It is going to be customs, probably nothing but customs. I think it would be a cool thing to try because I always mix them up. I'll do like a couple of customs, then a bunch of like other stuff like RLCs, Super Treasure Hunt, Skydo House, premiums, whatever, you know, uh, just kind of mix it up. Uh, people usually like that, but that does tend to go long. So let me know down in the comments, like, would it be a good idea to maybe do like a claim sale? I've done a bunch of claim sales before. They always usually go well. Because um, I don't have to be live. I just make a video with the lot numbers and then all you have to do, well, it's live. Um, then all you have to do is go to my Instagram account and messages and tell me which one, you know, you're claiming. And whoever, based on the timestamp, whoever, whoever claimed it first, unless you're a channel member on YouTube, uh, they get dibs. Uh, but if you claimed it first... Um, you win it, you know what I mean? So I've done that before a bunch of times. I've seen other YouTubers do it. I think that's not a bad idea. <sighs> so let me know if I should do a claim sale because you, I'll run that for like a week and people can keep claiming stuff because you don't know who claimed what, you know? So uh, people can keep claiming for a week and then uh, I send everything out and everybody's happy. <laughs> so, all right, let's open this up. So yeah, I think I want to do that. I want to do like a claim sale first and then do the nothing but customs auction. Oh my god. Okay, there's no sticker on this so we don't need to do the presentation. Nice man, another freaking 55 Chevy Gasser. Purple and yellow, Moon Eyes livery. Look at that beauty. Ah. Make sure it's in there, man. All right, there you go. Look at that. That is so cool, man. Dude, I love Steve's customs. I have a bunch. I have a one or two of his gassers. Right, yeah, there's one of his gassers right here. There's his purple Batmobile. I think I have, oh yeah, I have, I think, two of his uh, Fox Body Mustangs. But yeah, so there you go. That is freaking awesome. So there you go. There's a good example of what you can expect at the uh, Hot Wheels for Ukraine auction at the end of March. I don't know what date that's going to be. So that's a cool one. Steve, these are like packaged perfectly, especially for unboxings. I don't have to sit there like, oh, I can't get this. <laughs> you know what I mean? Dude, that mat is awesome. I can't get over that mat. Thank you. Really appreciate that. Straight up, I needed it. <laughs> okay, cool. This one is the full hot order here. Oh, I know people love these. All right, so let's give you the full presentation first. So this is the, I forget the year. Anyway, pickup truck, look at that. 
A little surfboard in there. All right, let's get it out. Look at that Hot Wheel surfboard. That is cool. <laughs> Trying to hide. I really hope it's focusing on this. All right, maybe that was too close. I don't know. So yeah, beautiful truck, man. Beautiful work on all. I love the color, by the way. It's like burnt orange. Nice five spokes, staggered wheels, Goodyear tires. That is fantastic, sir. I know. That's awesome. <laughs> uh, wait. Yeah, this way. All right, so there you go. Another uh, fantastic custom by Miniature Mustangs for the next Hot Wheels for Ukraine auction. All right. Okay, guys, uh, sad but true. We're coming to the last custom. Another one by Steve. And um, hopefully I made sense about all this auction stuff. Just uh, remember at uh, the end of... Um, March at the end of this uh, coming up month um, last Saturday I'm gonna make a lot more videos talking about this I'm gonna be doing unboxing videos from other customizers um, other donations or whatnot uh, but yeah just let me know if you guys think that um, uh, claim sale would be a good idea I think it is uh, it makes kind of it kind of makes things you know a little simpler like people can just kind of um, you know, if they like something, they can send me a message saying claim. And if you win, I send you the bill and you PayPal me the money, uh, including shipping, and uh, it's all yours. And uh, all of that, except for the shipping money you send me, will go straight to Ukraine as well. And that way we don't have to mess around with the auctions. Um, you know, uh, we'll see how it goes. So let me know. <laughs> Cheers. Shout out to Fireball Tim. Check him out, man. I have a, um, I commissioned that guy for a um, really cool piece. If you guys, here's a sneak peek. If you guys go to uh, Fireball Tim uh, on Instagram or whatever, and if you see this Fast and the Furious car, I commissioned this. So yeah, Fireball drew this because I asked him to. He signed this for me as well. So yeah, there's your little preview. I'm going to be doing a video on this soon because I also have a bunch behind me up on the wall that you might not see. Right there. <laughs> I can't see what I'm filming. All right, quick little plug to Fireball Tim, who's an awesome dude. He designed uh, hot uh, Hollywood cars, Batmobiles. Anyway, the list goes on. I love car people. I love like, you know, diecast collectors, car designers from Hot Wheels or movies or whatever. I'm a huge fan of that stuff. So a lot of those guys are in the Hot Wheels community. So it's, it's freaking awesome. Oh yeah, boy. I was hoping there'd be one of these in here. Miniature Mustangs. <laughs> yeah, I spoiled it. So yeah. I was like, yeah, I hope there's a Mustang in one of these. <laughs> there you go. Fox body. I love I love his little little tiny stickers. I need to order some of those. Alright. So I have one with similar liveries with the 21. Somewhere back here. Yeah, they're in the back there. <sighs> All right, so check that out, guys. Look at that beauty. I'm trying to cover my eyes so it doesn't focus. 
on me. Dude, I love these, man. Great work, Steve. <sighs> Beautiful. Oh, this is the SVO. Yeah, 84 Mustang SV. I saw the little uh, wing on the back. Sorry, I saw the little wing on the back, and I'm like, oh, that's awesome. Okay, guys. So, Steve, thank you so much, man. Here's Steve's beautiful... Oh, let's do it this way. Steve's three beautiful customs for the Hot Wheels for Ukraine auction. Be ready for these. Wow. And his donation of JB freaking diecast patina series. So not to scare anyone off, but most customs go for like, especially this level and Steve's level, they go like, like JB actually sells these on his website for more than $75. He does do shows on his uh, whatnot where they're in blind boxes, so you can't choose what you're buying, but they're all good, so it's all good. But um, yeah, those go for about 70, so like 80 bucks. So that's what customs go for, especially ones with so much detail like this. And Steve's are the same story, man. Like, it's it's painted, um, the wheels are swapped, they're uh, tapped and drilled, so they're screwed back in. Um, there's decals, there's incredible detail on headlights, taillights, all that good stuff. So, <sighs> most customs go, like, they start, like... $40 and up, you know, and then there's people that make like body kits on them. Those are like a hundred and up um, Then there's like team transport stuff and all sorts of different things and basic wheel swaps where you just take a car drill it open s swap the wheels price ranges are like 10 20 bucks at the most depending on the car because the car has value too But if all you did was wheel swap it uh, like a mainline car, that's 10 bucks you know, it's like a $2 car, wheel swaps, the wheels cost about 5 bucks. So the person that did it gets $1 or $2 for their effort. So that's why you need to keep that in mind. So like just a wheel swap is not cheap either. It's 10 to $20. And customs, they have to start at like $40, you know. So uh, keep that in mind when uh, the auction starts going. And uh, sometimes people get good deals, man. So uh, we'll see how it goes. And also Steve donated this awesome RLC here. Uh, put it to the side, so <laughs> there you go. But it is an auction, so there's chances to get good deals. And Steve, thank you. <laughs> I guess 164, uh, Shop 164 is getting a, a free little uh, advertisement here. But uh, this is so cool, man. Uh, I'm so happy you did this. Thank you. I'm going to put that on my desk as soon as I'm done here. And I'm done here. <laughs> so yeah, uh, Steve, thank you so much. Everybody check out Miniature Mustangs right here on YouTube. Uh, awesome guy, amazing talented artist, and uh, just a good dude all around. So give him a subscribe at the least, and uh, check out his videos, man. Like I said, he does very generous giveaways, and uh, that's not why you should subscribe to him, but it's a bonus if you're watching his videos and stuff. Like He's like, here you go, guys. So it's kind of nice. Um, so yeah. Steve, cheers, uh, everybody, thank you for watching, and remember, don't forget, um, if you're a customizer and you would like to help out, reach out to me at bignaz at yahoo.com email, or on Instagram, uh, nostalgic underscore productions, and uh, just shoot me a line and be like, hey man, I want to donate something, and uh, we'll take it from there, so yeah, uh, I'm excited about this, uh, I think uh, I think this one's going to be fun, so customs only freaking hot wheels for ukraine auction so yeah spread the word if you don't mind let people know about this um and uh i'll see you all in the next video daily videos stay tuned <laughs> more unboxings coming soon too cheers whoa, whoa whoa don't forget guys as my sticker here says own your collection don't let it own you Bye.